The first Qibla of the Muslims, al bara may Allah be pleased with him, narrated that, we prayed towards Bayt al-Makdi's Jerusalem with the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him for sixteen or seventeen months, Safwan was not sure. Then it was changed to the Qibla, the importance of visiting Masjid al-Aqsa. Abu Huraira may Allah be pleased with him relates that the Prophet peace be upon him said, do not undertake a journey to visit any mosque, but three, this mosque of mine, the mosque of al-Haram, and the mosque of Aqsa, the second house of Allah on earth. Abu Dhar may Allah be pleased with him reported that he asked the Prophet peace be upon him, O Messenger of Allah, which mosque was first built on the surface of the earth, he said, Al-Masjid Al-Haram in Mecca, I said, which was built next, he replied the mosque of Al-Aqsa in Jerusalem, I said, what was the period of construction between the two? He said, forty years, he added, wherever you may be, and the prayer time becomes due, perform the prayer there, for the best thing is to do so that is to offer the prayers in time. The importance of donating to Masjid Al-Aqsa, Maimunad bin Sa'd may Allah be pleased with him relates that she asked the Prophet peace be upon him, O Messenger of Allah, tell us the legal injunction about visiting Bayt al maqadas the Messenger of Allah said, go and pray there, all the cities at that time were affected by war, if you cannot visit it and pray there, then send some oil to be used in the lamps. Asa bin Mayim killing the Dajjal. Mujami bin Jariyah al-Ansari said, I heard the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him saying, Asa bin Mayim will kill the Dajjal at the gate of Lud. The station of al-Isra and al-Miraj the miraculous journey of Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him. سبحان الذي أسرى بعبده ليلا من المسجد الحرام من المسجد الحرام إلى المسجد الأقصى الذي باركنا حوله لنريه من آياتنا إنه هو السميع البصير. Exalted is he who took his servant by night from Al Masjid Al Haram to Al Masjid Al Aqsa whose surroundings we have blessed, to show him of our signs, indeed, he is the hearing, the seeing. The place where hundreds of messengers of Allah are buried, the place where miracles were shown by Allah's wall, the place that Allah himself calls a blessed place, Masjid al-Aqsa, mentioned by name in the glorious Quran. We need to understand our responsibilities regarding safeguarding Masjid al-Aqsa, which is in great danger of being demolished by Israel. <laughs>